Hey, what's up guys? Your boy is Pilot 2K7 back with another Coastal Call Us episode here in Grand Theft Auto 5. Now today guys, I have a really exciting update I want to show you guys. This is awesome by PNW Parks fan. I want to give them a huge shout out. And if you like what you see, you want to check out this mod a little bit early before it is released to the general public. Definitely consider checking out the open beta by joining the Parks Benefactor program. Link can be found down below in the video description. Alright guys, so this is a new update two coast to call outs here we'll go ahead and bring up our menu so you now have this plain menu which is pretty awesome so i'm going to show you how it works here so let's go down here you can actually open and close the doors while you're in or out of the aircraft which is pretty cool we're going to have a couple key binding issues so you have to be careful about that so let's go ahead and open so as you can see we could open up the door now a cool thing we could load and unload cargo and drop cargo guys so we're gonna go ahead and try it out this is gonna be an awesome episode it's something that is a hundred percent brand new to GTA so let's go ahead and have some fun with it and um yeah so let's see what we have here today guys so we have some life rafts which are pretty cool and then we have some cargo over here as well which is pretty cool so let's go ahead and get everything loaded up here guys so what we are going to do is go to let's go to cargo management let's go to ooh, we're gonna put this on just because the rafts are a little bit bigger but it's okay so let's go to load cargo here so as you can see it gives us the option on what we want to load first or second so let's uh Let's load, let's load one of, which one should we load first? Let's load this one first. So we're going to press that. So that's on board. Let's load this one next. And I forgot to show you guys one other thing really quickly. Let me go ahead and unload it. Oops, I mean to put them in together. So one cool thing. You could kind of like push stuff around. Now, I didn't mean to unload both of these here on top of each other, but you could kind of like push objects around, which makes it easier for trying to load and unload stuff. So as you can see, this is like pretty much able to be pushed, which is pretty cool. All right, so let's go ahead and reload everything now. See, can I push this one? This is technically a vehicle, so it's a little bit harder to push. So we have to move the aircraft a little bit closer for that one. All right, so let's go ahead and load cargo again. Um, these are our two options, so let's load, let's load this first, let's load this second, and then I want to get closer to these, I want to load one more item here, so let's get the aircraft a little bit closer here, let's go ahead and push it back just a tad. Now if you're looking for anything to spawn, I just use menu to spawn, um, just search cargo and menu under objects and then you'll be able to find these cool um, cargo objects that you can load on. So pretty much you can load any type of vehicle or object as long as it could fit and if it doesn't fit you kind of force it to fit but it may possibly poke out. Alright so let's go back to load cargo. Let's load, oh we can load both of these. Let's load, let's do another raft. Alright, so that's on board. Oh, we can take this too. Oh, nice. Alright, so we are currently full, I believe. We got four pieces of cargo on board. So we have two rafts and two of these, like, generic cargo, which looks pretty cool. So let's go ahead and get ready to drop this here, guys. So we're going to go ahead and let's go to close doors. Alright, let's go ahead and get in. So this is going to be the fun part guys. We have a lot of new features once we are in the aircraft that I'm going to be showing you. So I'm thinking we could, um, let's head up to the station near Polito Bay. We're going to go ahead and deliver some, some equipment via uh, airdrop, which should be pretty cool. So, um, here we are in the cockpit. Now we do have some other views. This is a view of the rear door. So you go ahead and just open the door just to, so you guys can see. So we have the rear door. Very nice. And our next view, we can see all of the cargo back here, which is pretty cool. And we get back out here. Alright, so let's go ahead and take off. We're going to take off. We're going to head towards Polito Bay. We're going to try to drop our cargo. And uh, maybe we'll even try to recover the cargo. We'll see what happens. So I'm going to go ahead and turn this way. 
Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and do a direct takeoff. So if you guys are enjoying this mod so far, do me a favor, if you like this video, go ahead and show it by hitting that like button and leaving some comments down below. Let me know what you guys thought of this new update and if you guys would like to see more airdrop gameplay, that should be really, really cool. And I'm looking forward to see what else PNW Parks fan can do with this mod. All right, so we're gonna line up here and go ahead and take off. All right. We'll give it full power once we're on the actual runway. My controller's gonna die. Let's <laughs> turn that back on and full power. There we go. Alright, we are moving. It's gonna rotate. Landing gear up. And I'm gonna bank left over the over the beach there. Very, very nice. Nice takeoff there. All right. So, we're gonna head towards Palito Bay, like I said, guys. Off the south coast, I don't think we're gonna help out with that call. Alright, so, we're gonna head to Palito Bay. There should be another available helicopter at the um, station to help out with that call. Let's go ahead and let this badge know we're kinda unavailable right now. Let's go ahead and head towards Palito Bay now, guys. So, if we open up the plane menu, you see we also have an autopilot um, button so that would maintain heading and altitude for you which is pretty perfect so Polito Bay is going to be here before we know it let's uh... I don't want to fly with a military base but let's just fly this way for a little while and let's put on autopilot and let's check out our cargo everything is good oh look out the windows guys you see the, the ground on the left and the ocean on the right very very nice very very nice all right let's um let's open up our doors because why not all right nice let's switch to the next view oh uh, look at that man yo we got to do some skydiving this looks so awesome all right um uh, let's turn off autopilot and i'm gonna try not to kill us here actually no i can't steer while in this menu so it's probably a good thing let's go ahead and turn right a little bit so what we're going to try to do is drop everything now. <laughs> it's going to be interesting. Um, I want to see if we could drop the life raft. Would it float? I'm guessing it should because it's technically like a boat. So let's try that first. Let's go to cargo management. Let's go to stage cargo. Reorganize cargo. I want to... It's gonna drop the, the drop them in order that we loaded them. So let's continue flying here. And uh, once we get close to the um, Paleo Bay station, we will get ready to drop our loot. And hopefully, there's a boat there that could recover everything. Now, I think it will drop the um, will drop the cargo on the beach. Possibly that's probably the smartest thing to do. And then everything else will drop in maybe the water. So we'll do a four drops all together. So let's go in for our first one here. Hopefully nobody's on the beach. Uh, let's go autopilot maintain. Alright, and let's go ahead and get to the back here. Alright, and let's get ready to drop. Drop, 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 drop. can't see it drop if I got it kind of drops like straight down where did it go Ooh. did we miss it did it drop oh yeah I don't think it dropped it oh we gotta stage it first I forgot all right let's try that again we're gonna have to do this quickly all right oh it's staged so it's now on the rear let's go ahead and get ready to drop it and drop it like it's hot and with a high visibility parachute at that uh, trying to get back outside. There we go. Alright, so we dropped it. I didn't see where it landed, but we dropped it. It is down somewhere. Alright, let's uh, circle back. Let's probably do it a little bit lower. That was pretty cool. So let's stage our next item. Alright, so next is going to be the raft. 
So the raft's a little bit technically too big, so it's not going to show on the actual ramp, but it's okay. So let's go ahead and take off autopilot. We're going to go ahead and lose some altitude. Oh, this is crazy. I feel like we're going to crash. I'm going to switch back here. Let's lose some altitude. We're going to drop this next one into the water, guys. It should float. It should float for us here. Alright, I wanted to drop it closer to the shore, but... Oh, 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 you can't stare when you're in that menu, always forget that. Alright, we're good, we're good, we're good, we're good. Autopilot. Alright, we are staged, we're gonna have to do this quickly, guys. Go ahead and drop. There it goes! Oh, this is so exciting. Oh, we nearly hit a boat there. Alright, let's stage another one, let's stage another one. Um, cargo stage, and let's drop again. This is so awesome though. Alright, let's drop another one. Alright, ready? There it goes. Out the back door. And that's gonna drop. Nice. So both of those are in the water. Let's go ahead and check them out. Make sure that they are successfully landed. And yes, they do float. Because they are life wraps. Makes sense. Alright, so we're going to try to get a boat to recover those life rafts and take them back to the station. So let's get the last bit of cargo. Let's drop it onto the beach there. We're going to go ahead and go, let's see, management. Let's stage it on the back. Get a little bit of lag. But hopefully we should be, we should be okay still. I think I spawned too many objects before. Alright, here we go, here we go. Sorry about that lag there, guys. Alright, so here we go. Yo, oh, there's a station right there. So let's go ahead and drop this last piece. Dang it. I think I dropped it too late. Oh, it's falling into the ocean. Oh, oops. Yeah, that was not the best. Alright. But it is dropped. That was pretty awesome, guys. Really do hope you guys have enjoyed this. Let me know what you guys think of it. Very, very cool. I think the lag is from me, like, spawning all of the different, um, objects. Because I spawned them and then I kind of made them persistent. So they're not going to disappear. But this is awesome. We got to see if we can fit some people back here, too. That would be pretty cool. <laughs> Yo, this will be pretty cool. Oh, we gotta watch altitude, too. We gotta watch altitude going down. Oh, this is so nice, man. This is so awesome. Alright, so. Let's see if we can recover everything now. Um, that would be pretty cool. So let's go ahead and switch to a boat. And let's see if we can recover everything. Alright, guys. So, we are not the Polito Bay Station. Let's see if we could grab a boat. and see if we can go recover those life rafts that we dropped there. Oh, I see one right over there, too. Alright, do we have any boats in here? Yes, we do. Uh, we're not going to use... Oh, my controller keeps dying. <laughs> Let's not use any of these motor life boats just because they're a little bit too large. We don't need to take those out. I think the defender would do its justice or even a response boat medium would be fine. Let's let's use a defender. So let's head over and grab the defender boat and let's see if we can recover these um we can recover the um life rafts and then bring them to the stage. So I'm gonna take the orange one and jump on board. Let's get in. Turn our lights on since we are kind of doing something somewhat important here. It's maybe a little bit hard to get out here. There we go. Oh, alright. I see one. Oh, I see two. Two's over there. Alright, cool. So, I'm going to get uh, one unit to tow this one and I'll get another unit to tow the other one. And we'll take them back in. So these are the life rafts here. Very, very nice. So let's request a vehicle or a boat to come tow this one. Alright, so there's a boat on the way to come get it. <laughs> and they sent a motor life boat. Alright, so they're going to come get this one and I'll grab the other one and we'll take it back. 
So if you guys did enjoy all of this, make sure you guys do me a favor. Go ahead and smash that like button because these are some awesome mods. Make sure you guys check it out as well if you want to get early access to it. Or if you just want to follow it, check the um the um the update page as well. That's also linked down below. So as you can see, they're gonna go ahead and tow that back and let's go ahead and recover the other one. And again, sorry about the bit of lag we're getting here at the end of the episode. Not sure what's causing that. But uh, let's go grab this one. Oh, it came up fast than I thought. Uh, let's go grab this one now. Oops. And let's go ahead and tow. We'll tow it with our boat. Uh, okay, I guess we're I'm not able to tow it, but it looks like the other units were able to tow it. So, we'll get another unit to come tow it, since we can. Alright, oh, there goes the defender right over there. They're going to go grab this one. So, this episode worked out really well for the most part, guys. Like I said, I'm going to have a lot of fun doing cargo jobs. This does work with other aircraft as well, so we also have the C... The C-27, and I believe we can also use, eventually use other aircraft, so maybe even like the C-5 or C-17 transport planes of the Air Force, that would be pretty cool as well. So let me know if you guys would like to see more of this mod. Again, I thank you guys for watching. Hit that like button if you guys did enjoy, and let me know what else you guys would like to see. Wait a minute, where did this extra life raft come from? That's interesting, another one just popped up there. We only dropped two. That's pretty interesting. But anyway, guys, thank you guys for watching. I really hope you guys enjoy. And I will see you guys in the next one. Peace.